Yeah. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Chad. We're back at it again with uh, the next Arena Grinding video. Arena Grinding 113 in the house. Before we get on the way, let's let's check out my fans up in 5001. Uh, I love you guys all. Thank you all for your support, as always. Uh, yeah, buddy. <laughs> yeah, buddy. So, again, guys, for those that are new to the channel, welcome to the channel. If you guys know me from way back when... Um, I have been a uh, uh, big, big fan of the free-to-play game in the community. Uh, if you guys know Joe, aka Lord Kamuka from the 5001 community, he created this channel many, many months ago, and I've been in there chilling with the group. We have a lot of old school and new school people. Great community. Every so often you get a troll, but it is what it is. As the as the game grows, the channel grows, and we get a lot of people. But overall. A very very great amount of people and I love them all so thank you guys all for your support uh, yeah buddy all right so yeah here we go guys I'm gonna go ahead and get right into it we're gonna do some arena Ooh, yeah all right we're sitting at Guardian let's go ahead and refresh started from the bottom never hit yep yep um, I think today we're gonna go back to uh, some of the videos that I did back in the day with regards to um, uh, using some people that are, uh, you know, busting out some more of the Brian Magician kind of things. I know that uh, you guys have recently seen me do a lot of um, arena offenses, basically with my arena defense, you know, utilizing Orion. Orion. But uh, one of the things that I was doing um, for a while was um, using some of my um, uh, better despair runes on, on Draco. I'm sorry, on Corona. And I took a break on Draco, but I went ahead after we ruined the removal day, went ahead and re-ruined him up. He's definitely not where he used to be. He was at 30k, uh, but his speed's right there. So we're going to try to use him. Uh, for those that have, you know, uh, re gotten him or gotten Orion or whatnot, um, I'm, a bit, I'm a big, big fan of the uh, dab double attack bar, you know, arena offense. I think that gives you so much more... Um, so much more variety in what you can, can use, right? So there's a lot of units out there that um, are super strong, but because we don't have some kind of protection like a Chloe or whatnot, we can't we can't go ahead and utilize them. Um, but with the you know on the AO side, when you have a you know a fast uh, attack bar manipulator, um, you know you can basically push everybody's attack gauge to the front, and then hopefully you know finish off with a, a nice uh, sequencing of units all together in order to you know get get that nice uh, sniping skill done and get it out the way so that's what we're gonna go ahead and do um, we're going to start right here uh, let's see I think we can basically keep this the way we were going might as well right um, gosh yeah we should be fine we should be fine let's go ahead and run it let's go ahead and run it so Definitely want to go ahead and get the uh, that Fire Monkey King out the way. I'm hoping he's kind of a yellow setup. Um, this is one of those interesting situations where, um, you know, when the, when they fail like that, um, you know, should I go, you know, should I go with my AOE stun with a defense break so I can finish off with Chandra with a big hit? Or do I go with the attack bar? And I think the best way to go about it is the attack bar because Orion's going to go. And if Orion pushes... Um, Chloe back up to the front of the line um, then I would be in a lot of in a lot of trouble but uh, I don't know I don't know probably could have gotten away with it but we want to just play play the conservative approach right now making sure we get the DPS out the way now I definitely want to kind of unload and try to get it unfortunately I can't I can't um, I can't send the fire monkey king but it's all good we got a couple of turns here with immunity big big fan of uh, you know bringing in a bringing in a unit that provides immunity now there's your fail right there i should not have been hitting draco i'm sorry i should not have been using draco to hit him i'm increasing the trigger but um you know looking at the attack gauge uh, uh of my particular team guys i noticed that i'm going to be going next so i went ahead and uh i went ahead and just you know went with it yellow right just went went and go ahead and kill it so uh i think we're just gonna go ahead even though there's nothing really much to do i'm gonna go ahead and just work on Orion. I feel like he's the only one that can essentially slow me down from, you know, achieving my goal. But overall, uh, you know, we got this one down. So, yeah, it's fun. I, I love it. So, like, I think the first time I got Draco and started using him, you know, I didn't have Theo. I was using, like, I was using Sigmaris. 
um, and uh, I think Chandra or Sigmaris and somebody else, whatever. So it was kind of fun. What we can do here, since Draco is um, is a uh, uh, you know hit point based leader, we could definitely bring Jewelton or somebody in there to kind of help you know provide a little bit more uh, hit points overall. Um, but of course, it's all about you know what we need on that particular team. You know, we got a couple light defense breakers. I can sit there and use Jutan as the uh, tank and go ahead and hug with uh, Chandra. But uh, we'll see what we can find. I'll probably go ahead and do that, see how it goes. Unfortunately, Jutan's not on Violent Revenge anymore. He's on Violent Guard. Um, just got some really nice subsets on the guard, so I've been kind of going with that. Um, but yeah, let me see. Let me see, let me see. Can we do something? Oh, is that the same? Did they have the same team? Oh, okay. Pretty darn close. Pretty darn close. Ugh. Not really a fun team to deal with. Just boring, right? <laughs> it's like stupid boring. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I'm trying to think. I kind of want to. I kind of want to be able to use throw into soon there without the Chloe action, but it looks like we're gonna have to deal with the Chloe all day. Ugh. Ooh. Let's see. What can we bring? What can we bring? Well, let's see. Um, let's see if we can bring Lido or Lido. <laughs> Leo, Leto, whatever like that. There's a fail. Draco, um, Theo, and then we'll go ahead and bring Leica. Leica and, and um, Theo have the same speed, but Theo, you know, goes is going first in this particular setup. Um, I might be able to get that one shot. Yeah, buddy, where's my where's my Gambella at? Gambella, can I get a one shot? Let's go. Let's see if we can knock out the Fire Monkey King right away. Oh my God, I hate my life. I hate it. I hate it because now Theo is going to wreck face. Hopefully not on Leica. But uh, we'll have to deal with losing that one turn here. Oh, it's no bueno. It's no bueno. So again, I can't hit Theo right now. Can't hit anybody that I really want to hit right now. Um, but let's see if we can make it do what it do. Oh, 6K. And I think he only lost 10% health, guys. We might have to redo this fight because he is more of a tankier setup here. See if we can get a little stun action. Oh, that's never good. That's never good, but that's never failed like it before. That's never failed him. Oh my God, so sick. Love that stun. Clutch. Oh my goodness. Oh, don't you do it. Oh no. Oh my God. Oh, where's the defense when you need it? Tell you what though, I tell you what though, I'm gonna have to run this back. This guy's making me look stupid. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's do it again. Oh my god. You know what? I'm so stupid. I, I should have known better. So I I fought in Syrian many many times in Guild Wars. Always bringing them some good some good units or whatnot. So yeah, that's kind of that's kind of funny that I I just realized I ran into him. So um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let's go ahead and do something a little bit different. I know we got Draco in there, but let's go ahead and bring um, Delphoi. Let's see how Delphoi can do it again. Um, I definitely like to bring uh, Delphoi in, in situations like this so I can go ahead and reset because I want to do me. <laughs> God, I want to cry so much here, right? The fails are real. The fails are real. Um, but yeah, we obviously have to bring in immunity here. There's really no way around it. We're just going to have to wait it out. Talk about some bad luck. Oh, my God. Look at that. Violent proc, violent proc, violent proc. Oh, my goodness. And, of course, uh, uh, you know, having the win unit is nice. It, it definitely brings an additional target for the Fire Monkey King if they can't land a defense break. But still, it's just a pain because I can't, you know, I can't do what I want to do. Still, Still got the immunity on. And seeing that, seeing that he's going YOLO, 
with his Fire Monkey King. Let's see if we can take away one of the defense breakers. Nope, guess not. Guess not. Oh my god. This guy though, I'll tell you what. Did I already reset it? I think that's a fail. I think I already I think I already hit him, right? I don't even remember. But now it's the ooh. Is that despair revenge? Was that despair revenge? I didn't even see. Oh come on, get a nice hit. Oh my god. Oh my god, this guy's making me rage. He's making me rage. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, there you go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, oh, keep that, yeah. Don't don't you violent proc. I need to kill you like right now. There we go. Alright. Alright. Now we're good. We're going to run it out. So yeah. This is another one of my arena offenses that I like to use. Um, obviously, Theo, like a combination, is really good. Both of them don't have um, any issues with, uh, well, let me take that back. Laika doesn't have any issues with glancing hits, so it kind of helps when I'm going up against water-based units in addition to all the other elements. But uh, because Theo's leader skill provides critical rate and um, Delphoy's first attack is based on providing a slow um, if you critically hit, it's definitely nice to have it on board. I think I have about 50 to 60% critical rate already, so having, having him as a leader puts me at a very, very high amount of critical rate um, to get the job done. So it is fun. It is fun. And it's nice. It's a little bit safer, right? Two healers versus one. Always good to be, to be cautious here. All right, so let's see what we got. Oh, man, I tell you what, I don't really like this... Um, Actually, God, I'm thinking here. How much speed can do you think that this guy has, right? I know it's crazy because there's not... There's two firebase units, but it... Call me silly, but I think I might be able to eke this out. <laughs> we go with YOLO. Let's see if we can do it. Uh, if you guys, if I've already, hopefully I'll show you the video, but I've recently changed my Lucian's um, to go ahead and, uh, you know, still do the damage that they're trying to do, but add themselves, uh, add themselves a little um, different runes to give them the speed that I want. So me not, you know, me trying to do this without using double Lucian uh, would be kind of silly, right? Because it's just... Uh, you know climbing up in the ranks you got to take every opportunity to get those fast kills and that's what it comes down to You know every team is beatable, but you know at the speed that you can beat him is really important So it's good to see more Bernards in the mix people are using a lot of Bernards up in here um, Let me see let me see another slow team Don't want to be around forever, right? Let's get refreshed. See what we got here. Gosh, I want to see somebody I want to see somebody here I recognize um, Obviously, I still recognize Fury. I recognize Public Enemy. Raid the Panda sounds familiar. Does sound familiar. Let's see. Let's see. Gosh. Can we find a team without the... Oh. Ew. Ew. I wonder how fast that Orion is. I wonder how fast that Orion is. Probably faster than me, but oh, uh. <laughs> I was like, I am gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I am gonna do it. I'm not. I, I hate, I hate those Orion versus Orions because it can get, it can get real nasty real quick. But it'd be silly not to do this one, right? Um, the uh, this particular team, I feel that it's very, very doable given my situation with my setups and whatnot so um let's see if we can get a death break on this guy i kind of like i kind of like to take out orion if i can get the jump on him because i know that's something that could take out right now like i just did and not have to worry about um you know having you know attack bar manipulation that's the edge that i got um again a lot of people argue right you know go for the biggest threat i do feel that the biggest threat is theo right but um you know, as far as, you know, looking at the overall threat at the end of the day, the amount of turns that a, that a particular team like this can get, to me, 
um, the threat can be Orion, you know, providing, um, depending on how he's specced, he could be, he could be despair, you know, so he could be providing stuns in addition to that attack bar manipulation. Um, and again, the ability to clear him out, you know, within one shot, I mean, that's huge. Regardless of what I do on Theo, Theo's always going to get himself the opportunity to, you know, to violent proc and essentially, you know, get force enough to maybe one shot or get, you know, get one of my units very, very low. So, um, but again, because I have the jump on him now, it's definitely controllable, right? Regardless of how many lucky violent parks you have, I'm always going to have the edge because I'm getting more turns per round due to me having Orion and him not. Just taking the sweet time. All right. I think we're set on the auto mode here. I like it. I like it a lot. Let me see if I can get... Find maybe one more or two. Um, again, I think I've said this before, but every once in a while, the video still get carried away. Um, Going to be in trying to incorporate the smaller vids, guys. Um, I do want to give a quick shout out to all of my um, supporters that have been following me for quite some time. It seems to be that, and this kind of goes for a lot of YouTubers um, out there, that while we make, you know, entertainment videos for you, and some of them can be, you know, a little bit longer than most, um, it seems to be that the, you know, people, you know, basically stay in, in tune with the video, uh, you know, before they get distracted with somebody else or only watching, you know, a fraction of it. So I kind of want to, um, you know, get to get to that, get to the point, you know, provide content, but not, you know, keep you there, you know, where you're falling asleep, you know, on the thing here. So, uh, let's see. Can we get? Uh, ooh, we kind of have to, right? We kind of have to, like, it would be silly not to, you know, go for this. So, we haven't done Sigmaris yet, right? We haven't done Sigmaris yet. We'll go ahead and do that one again. Let's go with. Let's go like that. Let's go that. And then let's go like that. Because. Um, Sigmaris, I think has 80 crit rate, but I want to make sure he's, he's, um, you know, going down all the time. He's only at 13k hit points, so I'm going to go ahead and just take her out the way right now. Actually, ooh, hold on a second. Ooh. Ooh, oh, man. Ooh. How do I, dude, this is going to be hard. Do I kill, do I get the one shot and kill her? Or do I bring Theo down? And then have the opportunity to kill both at the same time. I think I need a... Oh, whoa, whoa. Is that a tanky one? Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. We got ourselves uh, we got ourselves something else here. Might have, we not, might have to play a little game. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Stealing the bars like a boss. Got to get it out the way. There we go. Man. A tanky Dark Hell Lady. I have yet to see that one. Um, that was a surprise, for sure, for sure. Wasting the seas, but I want to be able to have the opportunity to do exactly that. Freeze them when I can. Um, you know, for those that are still looking for a really, really good water unit and haven't been fortunate enough to pull Theo, you know, the Sigmaris is definitely out there. Definitely a great unit. Um, really shines when it is skilled up and you get those nice, you know, runes on. Um, for me, it's not going to shine as much as you've seen other people in the past because... Um, I have uh, mediocre runes. I don't have the. I don't have my best runes on them. But again, it's still an opportunity to, um, you know, still still a great unit to use. So I'm gonna try to use them here and there when I can. I think I took a break with Sigmars for the longest time because again, I was always in that scenario where I, um, you know, he just I can make him do damage, but he was too slow. Or if I made him, you know, fast, he just didn't do enough damage to get that one shot in. And that's that's what I like to use him for sniping. Sniping the team and knocking them out, um, you know, as, as soon as I can. So, 13k. Oh, it hurts so. It hurts so much to see him not do the damage that he that he generally does. But it is what it is. I'll let it. I'll, I'll let it. You know, I'll, I'll live with it. I mean, obviously, I, I think maybe that's not the damage is not too bad. But wow, we're getting some rare units. All right, what is this? What is this? <laughs> What is this? Let's see what the changes have been made to this. Um, oh, Charge attack, stun, recovers the HP, and provokes the enemy, and jumps the enemy territory to attack the enemy. You seek 
sequentially attack all enemies and decrease the defense. Ooh, AoE defense break. I like it. I like it. We got Emma. I still got to build her. And Fermion. Not a big fan of Fermion, but maybe this guy can prove me wrong. Um, let's, see. let's see what we can do here. With this particular team and you got the AoE defense break, I think we're going to have to go with... Uh, Actually, let me see. Let me see. Can we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on. I think we got some. I think we got something going on here. I think we got something going on here. Let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna do. I kind of wanted to bring. Um, Chandra with, with two dark units, you know, they're definitely going to be focusing down or whatnot or whatever. But I, I still think uh, Laika can get the job done here. I'm really not sure what this guy's going to do as far as um, this, this dark penguin, but I would like the opportunity to kind of go for him quick, and it's really, really hard to do that when you got yourself. Look at that. How can you not crit? 85 crit. Oh my goodness gracious. Now I'm mad. Now I'm about to turn it up. You wanna get it? I'm gonna show them what it is. I'm trying to mess me up. Is there stuns? Does stuns work on this guy? Despair? Despair Draco? Is it working? Come on, there we go. Get it! Ooh. Oh my god, thank you. Alright, thank you. Is it just me or did that uh, Emma still not cast her stuff? Oh there it is, there it is. Yeah, very nice, uh, very nice unit there. Good old Dominator. Come on. This guy doesn't want to land him. Now, now this is when I need my hug, right? Now this is when I need my hug. Ooh, take note of that damage, guys. I think he's YOLO. 11K without no defense break. We got to pay attention to that kind of stuff. Let's see if we can get it done. Or maybe he just has an absurd amount of defense. Get a stun one time. Oh my goodness. Stop. You stop it. You stop it. Oh dear. It looks like we're going to have to run it back again. This is so embarrassing. So embarrassing. Oh, break it. Break it like it, like it, like it. Come on. God. You would. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my goodness. i tell you what, man. i tell you what. Oh, yeah. Procket, Procket, Procket. Ooh, ooh. Probably should have hit him one more time, right? Oh, my God. That's gross. Just gross. Thank you. Such high defense. What a unit. What a unit. And of course, it's always nice to have a defensive buff from Emma. Nice little combination there. <laughs> oh my god. This guy though. Oh man, let's not waste any more time. Do we got another sword? Do we got another sword? I just got punked by Fermion. Even if we brought Hug, right, we're still going to have the issue with Fermion removing the stuff, so, um, what can we do? What can we do? Let's going to have to take a slow here with more of a tankier approach. That's weird. God, here's the funny thing too. I really, I really feel like that was some, that was some bad luck. Like, I really feel we should be able to, you know, take it down or whatever. And I think, I think since we can get this guy out the way early on, we're not. I mean, continuous damage, glancing hit a little bit, but I feel like Orion might be, might be a little bit better as far as 
getting some of these harmful effects down because it looks like their hit, you know, their heals are based on the hit points, right? There's no too soon or whatnot, so hit point disturb can go a long way here. Let's see how we do. Let's see how we do. Let's run it. Let's get a little, I mean, here, here's a, here, here, only Childish does this, right? Only I do this, where um, I, I just lost the fight because my team was like, you know, quasi YOLO, whatever. Wow. <laughs> and then I'm like, oh, let's, let's take my YOLO team and let's make it more YOLO, right? That, that, that makes sense. That makes perfect sense. Look at this violent proc. Oh my God. Oh my God. The fails are real. Oh dear Lord. The fails are real. Don't even want to continue. This guy though. Oops, I just, I, I thought I was on Draco. That's a fail. That's a fail. Oh my goodness gracious, sorry. Let's run it back one more time since this guy's just making me look stupid up in here. Let's see what we can do now. Let's see what we can do now. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, 15 seconds. 15 seconds for that sword. My goodness gracious. Wow, dude, that is, isn't that something though? The, uh,. This particular thing, man, I tell you something. Wow. Unbelievable. Now, I wasn't, I should have been painting to that speed on that particular unit. Um, I did not get an opportunity to check it out. Let's go ahead and. Get a little bit more DPS here. But we'll go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to build another buff removal. Possibly build up my Emma. I think Emma can do that, right? I'll have to take a look. Let's see, should we get a third time's a charm on the fails? Oh, look at that, I even, I, I got it. Like, oh, there's a resist, there you go. I was wondering where that fail was coming in. The fails are real, people. <laughs> the fails are real. Oh, man. Defense, how much is that defense gonna help you, sir? Oh, let's see here. Wow, that is something else. I tell you what, I tell you what, that is, that is quite amazing. I mean, obviously his damage improves when the, uh... <laughs> did, did my, did one of my strongest like one hit units just seriously uh, like fail miserably? Like, wow. All right, should we, should we take it in reverse? That is amazing. Look at that damage. Fine then, we'll leave, we'll leave him alone since he's slow as all hell. And we'll just kill everybody else. Because obviously, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Right? But it is what it is. We gotta give that guy some shout out there with those runes on the guy. He's pretty, pretty uh, heavy on the damage. I guess that's just a, a, a great reminder, guys, of the fact that, you know, even though, you know, certain particular units, you know, don't, 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 they don't get a lot of love for whatever reason. You know, when it comes down to doing the, the work that you got to do to get those runes, I mean, it's, at the end of the day, it's what's going to get it done. So, you know, shout out to that guy. I thought I can, I thought I can take a, a weaker team or whatnot to take him out, but I underestimated the power of the dark, uh, dark archangel. Again, though, you know, I, I ain't going to lie. You know, I definitely made some, uh, made some more liberal, uh, uh, you know, decisions when it comes to taking on that team, but it is what it is. We got it done. It only took us 17 times, but it's all good. Still hanging around in the G1, G2. Um, you know, hopefully here, uh, maybe I get that. I got this Sunday off. Maybe I can actually test my luck and see how we do to see if I can, um, you know, get up there in the G2 ranks. See how we do. But yeah. 
That's it, guys. Thank you all for tuning in for the Arena Grinding episode number 113. It's your boy Childish. Childish Plays checking out. Take care, and we'll see you next time, guys. We're out.